these evil things come from within and defy the man. Nobody can know man more than the one who made him. This is Jesus' diagnosis of every sinful act that it begins with a sinful thought. If you can't stop the thought, forget it. You can't stop the act. <laughs> if you nurture the thought, it will generate to the act. You can't stop that. It's, it's, a, it's a law. It's a law. Now, but we have the blood defense against every unwanted thought. Every unwanted thought, we can engage the power of the same blood of the everlasting covenant to stop them. Now, Hebrews 9, 13 and 14, the Bible says, well, if the blood of bulls and of goats, of the eyes of Anifa, sanctified the flesh, uh, sanctified to the purifying of the flesh, how much more shall the blood of Jesus, who through the eternal spirit offered himself without spot unto God, purge your conscience from dead works, deadly thoughts, to serve the living God. Amen. Amen. So when you notice any thought of the stranger trying to gain access to your system, by the blood of Jesus, I reject you. Not here. You don't belong here. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. You begin. Don't say it in tongues. Say it in words. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. You walk around your room. You pace around your office. The blood of Jesus. No way. Not here. Not here. Never. Not here. Never. Not here. Never. The thought just comes to you. Pack your luggage tomorrow. This is not your husband. And you start packing. Start packing. That's where it starts. Then you just walk into one realm of frustration. Regrettable frustration that cannot be recovered. And so, Slap your wife. He won't respect you without slapping him. Just slap him. Give him the dirtiest slap. Next time, he will mind how she talks to you. Then you start practicing. <laughs> you don't stop the thought. You can't stop the act. You can't stop the act. You, if you can't stop the thought, if you won't stop the thought, you can't stop the thought. If you won't stop the thought, you can't stop the act. Somebody's soul is changing. Amen. If that is you, let me hear your loudest amen. amen. Let me hear your loudest amen. amen. Don't mistake activity for sanctity. I beg. We have done many great works in thy name. It's I know you not. Depart from me, me, ye that walk iniquity. Matthew 7, 22 and 23. Don't mistake activity for sanctity. There is no substitute for sanctification in our work with God. Anointing is not a substitute. Depart from me. So many anointed men will not make heaven. We have done many great things in thy name. Depart from me, my friend. <laughs> we prophesied with your sin and came to pass. Depart from me. I labored for 50 years. Depart from me. Who's counting years here? You will not hear that sound. Amen. 